All right, guys, I have good news and bad news. Bad news is we just, me and my girlfriend just sold our bikes and we no longer ride, but I am on my way back to Malcolm Smith to pick up a new bike. Well, new to me, yeah, so a new bike. Um, they got us approved for the one, a uh, similar one that I wanted, which is pretty cool. Um, we're gonna go look at it and if I like it, I'll be signing the papers and bringing it home today. It's a 650cc, as a Z650cc uh, Kawasaki. So um, it's not the color I originally wanted, which kind of sucks, but I am a fan of a stealth color, which is black or murdered out. But the one I'm looking at, I believe is gloss black with some carbon. Um, if everything looks good, I'll probably take that one. If not, I'm gonna probably wait a couple more months and then, uh, or not even months, probably weeks until I have uh, enough to just probably just take a cash or something and see how that goes. But I'll pick up the vlog right now when we get over there. We're like 10 minutes away, 15 minutes away. So I'll pick it up when we get over there. All right, guys, we just finished signing all the paperwork. Here's my new Z650. New to me, but this is a 2021. Uh, it only has 1,200 miles. Um, it needs a good wash. Other than that, it's really good condition. A lot of people were interested in this bike because uh, people were saying it was a steal. Super cheap compared to getting a new one. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get like a good detail on it. It's not bad, honestly. It's really good, nice bike. First actual motorcycle. Uh, riding it here to the gas station was kind of scary, a little bit nerve-wracking. Um, but other than that, it's really nice. It's a lot faster than my Z125 that I still have. That I'm, oh, no, no, no. We traded it in, but I had to bring it in tomorrow. So I still have it, but I'm bringing it in tomorrow to trade it in. Get all that situated with. So yeah, I mean, it's not bad. Cool first bike. Coming the second bike. So yeah, you know, she ordered a new bike too, but hers is coming in three to nine weeks. No, wait. Um, Oh, it's my birthday. It's coming in uh, 60 to 90 days, so yeah, 3 to 8 weeks, I believe. Wow, my time frame's messed up. Holy crap. I'm just flabbergasted with all this right now. And yeah, it has a full tank of gas. They wouldn't just give it to me with no gas. So I'll pick up the vlog right now when I go there. Alright, guys. I'm going... Uh, I didn't record. I thought I was recording after that gas station video. I was like, oh, sick. I recorded a lot of good stuff. Um, but I got home and it wasn't recording tonight, so I was like, you know what, this would be a good time to film some stuff. Right. I just put this on too. It doesn't seem too loose. But hopefully it doesn't fall. I mean, it does. Alright, just fixed it. Made it more stable. It was washed at all. Oh, oh my god, I forgot. this isn't a damn drum. Whoa! I forgot, uh... I don't think this bike was washed at all the whole time it was there. I don't know how long it was there for, but when I checked on the internet, it was only there for two days before I bought it. <laughs> yeah, so I'm trying to get used to uh, having a big boy bike. I mean, it's not even a big boy bike. I mean, it's a cool bike. It's a 650. But I know people are going to uh, have an 800cc or something. I don't know. I don't know that much about bikes. I'm really getting into this, so I just feel less. But riding from the Kawasaki Z125 to this, holy crap, it is a big difference, and I like it. For it, it's gonna be shorter videos, like actual photo vloggers. Bike. <laughs> And, uh, you know, they had a cool, like, matte white with candy apple red. And, and that one caught my heart. But it was, like, 12 grand for a 650, you know? And this one, again, was used with only 1,400, no, 1,320 miles. I put the rest. And it was 7 or 8. I don't know exactly how much it was, but I got a uh, warranty on it for 5 years. But I put my visor down, man. This thing's bugging. like oh how different is it from a 125 to a 600 and a couple people were DMing me like is it scary it is scary honestly I I was a little bit more uh, nervous on this but one thing I noticed it's easier to freaking ride this than it was my drum like the, the, the clutch is so easy like I haven't stalled it yet I hope I never do whoa you see like you see that, that scared me 
Got the energy drinks. Oh, look at Chris's one. Oops. Let's go ahead and back up a little bit. Clear up or anything. It's just as soon as I drive it out, it pops just right away, man. It's a pop magnet. And I know, I know. People are like, oh, well, that's what you built, man, Cali. This shouldn't be a thing. Should not be a thing. It's still a little bit nerve-wracking. <laughs> wow, man, that is freaking scary. I do not like wow. <laughs> The thing falls, all the way up there. I used to go there when I was in middle school and high school. This place was weird. Last time I went there was with one of my good friends that uh, sadly. Alright. Uh, yeah, but you know, the reason I do that is because I've had people come to my house, knock on my door, or text me. I don't know how to get my number or DM me. Yeah, they're also in the house. Like, respectfully, guys, I won't come out. I don't know you, I would have to know you outside of my home. But yeah, it's just been sitting out here. Um, I'm probably going to garage it tonight. I'm tired of it being outside, and this bike will probably be garage too. Uh, I'm going to have to find something to do with it because with Cali heat coming, I don't want the paint to this color at all. But yeah, let me know what you guys want to see next. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. Uh, if you guys don't want more super vlogs or Moto vlogs, let me know. Now that I can finally go fast to go to places and do more cool things. <laughs>